So let's say I want to determine the mean and variance of the speeds of cars that are entering a junction. And what I do is I go out and I take a sample. So I've got a sample of 10 speeds of cars uh, right here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to find estimates for the mean and variance of the whole population by using this sample of 10 values. So what I can do is I can plug these straight into the calculator and use the one variable stats function to find the mean. So an unbiased estimate for the mean is just the mean of this data and I get 39.1. As for the variance, the variance as an unbiased estimator for the population is also given to us in the same calculation. And I'm going to show you how uh, where this is on the calculator in a moment. It gives you both SX and Sigma X. Sigma X is the one that we were using back in the first section of videos where I was showing you, introducing you to the standard deviation for the first time. Um, but it also gives you SX, which is the um, standard deviation, but we're dividing through by n minus 1 instead. So it's an unbiased estimator for the standard deviation. So an unbiased estimator for the variance would be that number squared. So it's 5.32 squared. Okay? And that would be our unbiased estimator for the variance. So just having a look at what that is. Approximately. So it's about 20.5. Okay, so that would be my variance and that would be my mean. So I'm going to show you how to do the um, unbiased estimator for the mean and the variance uh, on the TI-82 stats calculator. Here are the 10 numbers and what we want to do is we want to insert them into a list. So I'll clear that. So we go into edit, so stat, then edit, press enter, and then you enter your numbers into the list, okay, the 10 numbers, and then you want to go back to stat, to then along to calc and one variable stats, as we've done in previous videos. Then you want to select list 1, so second, and then number 1, that selects list 1, press enter, and here is the information that we need. The mean, the unbiased estimate for the mean is 39.1, given by x bar. And the standard deviation that we're looking at is sx, is 4.53259798. So the variance is that number squared. You also see that there's sigma x there. That's when we were dividing through by 10. So we want an unbiased estimator for the variance so we must divide through by n minus 1 so 9 that's why we get this number here